Let this be a message to all my lions and lionesses. You elegant, you radiant, you special. The sun shines just for you. Now understand, you know the Most High God has a plan. And whatever you want in this life, you will receive a hundred times over. Just keep him by your side, you know, keep him by your side and understand your creator loves you. And if you don't believe, I don't know what else to tell you. But the only thing I can say is that what you will be shining in his light is nothing short of something radiant, bioluminescent. You feel me? Your luminance will radiate all over the earth. I love y'all kings and queens, princes and princesses. But yeah, with that being said, kick that intro for me one time. Believe it. Peace and blessings, kings and queens. I had to go back to the old intro for that one. We had to bring some light, you feel me? We love that light. We live in that light. We need that light, you feel me? But on the cool, that's the intro for my other channel. You know what I'm saying? Uh, King KO and the Kingdom of uh, Truth. So y'all check that out too if y'all love that. But man, shout out to Wild Yellow 8 for tapping in, you know, on Instagram family. You know what I'm saying? Ain't no subscriber recognition, you know. It's just shouting out love for the family. And next up, shout out to Cali. You know, cool, you know what I'm saying? Cause she tap in, like, y'all read the message, man. She taps in, man, she shows love. She stay on your boy bumper, stay on my hip. Like, man, you posting today, get it done, make it happen. You know what I'm saying? Do what you're supposed to be doing. Shout out to you, queen, you 100, 100 for that. No cap, no cap, straight up. But on the cool, the next one we got a shout out, you know what I'm saying, is going to be another queen from Louisiana, you feel me? But uh, her name is MK. So, yeah, shout out to that queen, you know what I'm saying? And she's also the one that pushed, you know what I'm saying, the, the, the purpose for this video today. So, definitely shout out to her. Peace and blessings, queen. We love you. We support you and all that. You know what I'm saying? But, yeah, man, if y'all don't want to watch all this, man, y'all can go ahead and skip to 10 minutes if y'all came for the Fredo Bang at TBG. You know what I'm saying? But if not, stay tuned through it all. You know what I'm saying? Cause we talked about a lot. But yeah, make sure y'all tap in with the Seven Hardaway Biggest Step of Video. You know what I'm saying? In my personal opinion, I think it's heat. And I don't even think y'all caught, you know, I put him in Boulevard Don and them back on the block in the background. You know what I'm saying? And whatnot. <laughs> I thought that was pretty cool. But yeah, y'all tap in with that one, man. For real, for real. Make sure y'all like and subscribe. You know, share this video and whatnot. Show you boys some love. And one more thing I want to touch on before we dive in. I did make this post. You know what I'm saying? I had to get y'all. I apologize for everybody who believed it. But Boulevard Bubba got me first. So, you know, we did it right back i apologize family but yeah let's go ahead and get into the video though believe that first up we got that boy Quando rondo and Quando rondo posted a video to instagram a lot of his fans and supporters you know they was kind of you know disgusted with it so they try to cover it up like nah bro delete this one you know this ain't no good this ain't no good look i was definitely disgusted in it can't believe he did this man i don't know what this man was thinking with this one but look at that I, he's biting another man that is disgusting but y'all let me know y'all thoughts on that down in the comment section man that was definitely suspect you know what i'm saying so uh yeah let me know next up we got that man baby joe and he just dropped a new song and video and captioned the song he's back welcome back video done drop some hearts if y'all want it nah p.s watch my work 
y'all should have left me in that car basically uh trolling opposition you know what i'm saying y'all should have left me in that car y'all know how you've been doing but if you ask me for my opinion on this little snippet i would say it's hot garbage i wasn't feeling it i thought it was terrible you know what i'm saying bbg baby joe this one this one was garbage bro i can't even lie to you but next up uh well he also went on you know to share uh, a post about bbg iraq you know basically uh missing his brother you know what i'm saying and, and committed him you know and uh rest in peace to that man like we said before you know we ain't gonna never disrespect the dead man so uh yeah man rest in peace to that guy you know and all that and whatnot y'all let me know what y'all think about baby joe's uh song down in the comment section y'all gotta go listen to it but next up we got that man's you know what i'm saying no cap another uh nba artist and he was out with you know that boy um rod wave and the baby and pretty much, man, I wanted to know, man, y'all opinion on this. Because as we all know, Sauce Walker and the whole Slime organization, OG33 and NBA Youngboy, they all had problems, man. So uh, with Rod Wave rocking out with Sauce Walker, what do y'all think about him being with no cap right now? Y'all think that's an issue or do y'all think that's just really nothing? Let me know y'all thoughts on that down in the comment section. Then we got that boy Ben 10 going back to jail on five new charges after just being released. You know what I'm saying? Uh, he was released, you know, uh, exactly like five, six days ago, and he's already back in there. So, you know what I'm saying? In my opinion, I think it's an agenda from Baton Rouge Police Department. You know, they after all these guys, all the top guys, you know, doing too much, talking too much and having too much, you know, involvement and in everything going on. You know what I'm saying? Allegedly. And I, I just want to know, man, what do y'all think? Do y'all think it's really an uh, an agenda to, to target on their back or whatnot? You know what I'm saying? For them to come after these guys because this man just got released. So what did he do for y'all to pick up, you know what I'm saying, pick up on him five days, six days later? And if he was out, you know, being reckless like that, man, that that's just, man, I don't know what else to say. But hard-headed foolishness, man. Get it together, youngin'. You got your whole life to live, man. Don't waste it away, you know, being behind bars, you know what I'm saying? Like, get it together, man. Don't let them take your life, man. They already tried. You've been gone for like a year, man. Come on, get it together. But next up, we got that man's NBA young boy. And Say Cheese just shared a post, basically, uh, talking about how NBA young boy been gone you know what I'm saying for about 156 days and you know what I'm saying still had you know like 156 million streams you know he's still hot and as we all know NBA young boy will probably go down as one of the greatest artists of all time so with that being said man he will withstand jail he'll be one of those very few artists that will withstand jail so you know that's not a surprise to us you know what i'm saying and also he's involved with the whole situation that's going on too man you know with being locked away and and, and all the problems that's coming on tbg and nba side so he's another one you know what i'm saying so when we talking about that question of do y'all think that they really after them we talking about him as well you know what i'm saying and in my opinion like i told y'all i really do think that there's an agenda you know to take these men away but we're gonna dive more into that you know in the tbg side of everything but yeah, man, let's go ahead and move on to the next one. And next up, we got that man, James Harden, and he flexing and flashing his sacks, you know what I'm saying? Blowing a bag at nighttime with sacks closed, real boss baller mentality. Next up, we got my boy, you know what I'm saying? That boy Compton TG. And he previewing some new music, so let me know what y'all think. Killing all my features. And the Loke is real pressure. I vibe with the Loke, real talk. But yeah, man, this is another video of his jeweler, you know, doing his TG Tuesday chain, you know, his little rap thing he do. Let me know what y'all think about this, man. Next up, we got that man's little Dirk, and little Dirk brought some real heat to the party, you know what I'm saying? Them diamonds wet, you know what I'm saying? Like water, Niagara Falls, you feel me? Yeah, he brought that real pressure, man. Look at that, man. Look at they hitting off the light, man. Y'all let me know what y'all think about this. Wait till y'all see these rings. Ooh, man, y'all wasn't ready for that, was y'all? Y'all was not ready for that. 
man, this man is rocking some real mortgages. He was he rocking some real house payments on his fingers and wrists. It's crazy. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, man, next up, we got that man, Devin Haney, who used to be with uh, NBA Youngboy's, you know, girlfriend, Jania. But I guess they not together no more. Or, uh, Jania, however you say it. I believe it's Jania. But yeah, man, he he's he showcasing another bra. You know what I'm saying? So let me know what y'all think. Me and my girlfriend. <laughs> then he goes on to say manifest, which you definitely got to do. He's basically saying he's been with that girl, you know, since 16, 17. He's been on her bumper, and now he finally got her. So that goes to show you he's no longer with Jania no more. You know what I'm saying? So I guess NBA young boy, don't worry. Then he hit on a bet, 46 grand. Like, man. But yeah, next up, we got that boy Fat Chapo. And Fat Chapo, you know, was basically saying, free that boy Sleepy, you know, sharing the lyrics to his song and whatnot. You know what I'm saying? Fat Chapo went on, you know, just a posting spree, went on talking about Dutch, you know, and how, you know, he missed his boy. You know what I'm saying? And things ain't been the same. You know, nothing, nothing's been the same. The sun ain't rose the same since he lost his partner. You know what I'm saying? And then also free, I mean, since shows a picture about my boy Spinner Mitch, you know, that's my guy, man, real, real one. You know what I'm saying? Free that man, 100, 100, stand up guy. But on the cool, also, you know, he's free. He shows a picture too about uh, Jigga Fat, you know, and basically lets it be known, you know, he misses his brother as well. You know, that hey, that's just, you know, ugly situation, man. Losing people, you know, and things just, you know, you know how that goes. Then he also goes on to share something about Bo, you know, uh, Boulevard Dine, which we discussed and talked about in the Seven Hardaway video. So I advise y'all go check that one out. You know what I'm saying? Definitely uh, dope. But speaking of Seven Hardaway, Seven Hardaway, you know, shares his views for his streaming you know and basically says man it ain't even been that long and i'm already at 1.1 million so as y'all can see you know the guy the big home you know what i'm saying seven hardaway he taking off he taking off in his rap career you know what i'm saying he next up so y'all better be aware of what's going on and pay attention to the times 100 100 man but next up we got that boy uh roy black osama and roy black osama basically sends you know a message towards you know anybody who's messing with the opposition if you are like he said you are opposition you know what i'm saying ain't no way around it ain't no in betweens you know what i'm saying you straight up and op then we got that boy be easy as be easy you know what i'm saying always coming through letting it be known dropping game he says support your people and stop waiting until you see them make it to the top support them while they at the bottom you know what i'm saying and if y'all vibing with us support us right now and also you know i rock with that boy uh be easy that's my boy so i'm gonna support him y'all go tap in with his youtube channel you know what i'm saying hard body be easy he probably he finally put the you know little hyphen between the uh b and easy so it's easier you know to get his name right so go tap in with my boy man he, ain't no way he should only have 20 subs but yeah man next up spinner mitch man there's another uh fake page so y'all beware of this page man watch out for it you know what i'm saying as we see now there's that's like five fake pages that are made of this man you know what i'm saying and he ain't even you know a huge rapper yet you know but i guess you know he got a celebrity going but then we got that boy baton Rouge slim you know what i'm saying and baton Rouge slim got some things to say you know what i'm saying to to anybody you know anybody you know what i'm saying well i guess he was going at somebody in a camp but yeah man we could just say it was going in general you know he was talking to anybody but y'all check it out and see what my boy baton Rouge slim had to say we fuck for g down here Tell that spark for G down here. Yeah, bad news. I mean, look, anything I say be low, you hear me? Yeah. Stick to the code. You hear me? For real. I don't know how. Nobody else rock on your rocking with you. Who killer with you? And all that. You kill us, die every day. Y'all see, he ain't playing. I'm going to tell y'all one thing, man. Leave this man back and real slim alone. Because he going to take whatever, you know what I'm saying, anywhere y'all want to go, for real. On a cool, and I really rock with this dude, like 100, man. It's a real one. You can always tell when it's a real one by looking in their eyes. They say the eyes is the window to the soul. This man is a stand-up guy. It ain't got nothing to do with the interview, you know, the fact that he gave me an interview or anything. It's just because, man, we share the same story. And just sitting down and conversating with this man and just watching, you know, the way he move and conduct himself, I can see that, you know, he was really serious. And he about what he say. Ain't never lacking, so don't play with him. You know what I'm saying? If you run up on this man and think that he lacking, you're going to get your issue. 
allegedly. We're going to throw that in there because we ain't, you know, no police tip. But on the cool, man, this man is really about what he say he about. So stop playing with him. You know what I'm saying? And I totally agree with this man and how he feel in this situation because they keep on bringing up, you know, his brother that's passed away. You know, we got the same relatable story. You know, I lost my little brother too, man. And anybody that speak on him, you know what I'm saying, it's issues wherever y'all want to go with it. Like, for real, on the cool. You know what I'm saying? So much love to Bad Rush Slim, bro. You know what I'm saying? Chillax on these busters. You know what I'm saying? Because real talk, you know, ain't none of them going to move nothing. They just going to keep on running and doing what they do. But much love and much respect to that man. You know what I'm saying? That uh, whole interview will be dropping soon, family. But let's go ahead and move on. Believe that. Next up is the time y'all been waiting for. And we got that man's Fred Bang. He's finally been moved to, you know, the parish. You know what I'm saying? Out in East Baton Rouge, you know, the sheriffs, you know what I'm saying, whatever. But on the cool, as y'all can see, that's his name right there. You know what I'm saying? And a uh, queen sent me this, you know what I'm saying? So shout out to her. Like I said, M, you know, as y'all can see, that's his name right there. That's all his little case file and everything. So Fredo Bang has finally been moved. You know, it's been about, what, three weeks. You know what I'm saying? So we knew he was going to get moved eventually, you know. So we, we know that, you know, he survived the uh, little virus that was going on. Once again, I can't say that on here. But... As we all see, that means Ben 10 is in there, Fredo's in there, YB, I'm sure Lit Yoshi, you know what I'm saying, on his way. You know, all of them finna be in there pretty much. We all knew this. So it's like, what do y'all see happening when it when they all hit there? It's gonna be a lot of rumbling in the jungle, like no cap. It's gonna be some real stories that come out of there. And I'm gonna tell y'all right now, I'm gonna do my best to try to get some inside information as to what's going on in there and as to if we can see, you know, who's in there, you know, throwing the fisty cups, who in there, you know, making their body work the right way, you know, who's in there really tagging some. Who's standing on what they say? And I got a good, 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 very good idea that Fred O'Bang is going to knock at least one one or two heads. You know what I'm saying? Or whoever come his way in general. Now, let's not forget, you know, my boy Big Ball Savage in there. Spinner Mitch. You know what I'm saying? Boulevard Sleepy. I'm sure they're going to try to, like, mix the pods up. Ain't going to try to put them on a pod together. But eventually they'll be able to catch one another you know they always drop one fish in a pot in the tank where he don't belong so hopefully you know we'll hear some stories about that because that's what we want to see we want to see it stop being so much you know shoot them up bang bang and you know dudes really do what we do as men you know and handle it handle they wax the right way you know like my boy bad real slim just said link up when he's saying link up, he don't mean link up because he, you know, just trying to knock a head off. He's saying link up because he's trying to knock a head off with his fist. You know what I'm saying? He's trying to show, show y'all that he can beat y'all as, as like a man. You know what I'm saying? Like, it don't have to be no extras. He can beat y'all like a man. He don't have to take a life. He can really beat y'all up. And that's the same thing that Fredo telling y'all. You know what I'm saying? I'll really punch one of them down. That's why they don't want no issues. Another thing we got to talk about is the cap that been put out there that, you know, Lil Yoshi got a bond and whatnot. Lil Yoshi does not have a bond. You know, you got all these people out here trying to, you know, make this uh, narrative that Lil Yoshi is trying to rat on Fredo Bank. That's not in Lil Yoshi's blood. That's not in Lil Yoshi's nature. First of all, blood. Blood is a very important thing. Y'all got to understand. You know what I'm saying? When you lived, you created, you built like that, you brought up like that, you know that ratting is not allowed. You know, 90% of these dudes who rat got rats in their family or got innocent bystanders, you know, normal citizens who never chose this life in their family. You know what I'm saying? So I had to take a little breath right there. I know y'all heard that. You know, I was going in too hard. But on a cool, man. His, it's not in his blood. He come from a family of stand-up gangsters. That's the same thing I was telling y'all about Seven Hardaway. They come from a bloodline of stand-up gangsters. They don't come from no peons. So there ain't no room to be a peon in a family. Y'all gotta understand this, man. Now, if y'all come from that blood line, y'all know what that's about. You know what I'm saying? Uncles, pops, big cousins, they're going to teach you the right way and how you're supposed to move, how you're supposed to walk out here. So stop putting that out there, man. Stop putting out the cap narratives. Real talk. But hopefully we see some rumble in the jungle. And next up, man, we got that man's money bag, yo. And money bag, yo, I had to put right here. You know, I ain't want to put no uh, no separation because, you know, he rock with that gang. So no separation. Money bag, yo's Waikisha is number one on the Billboard uh, charts. Uh, on the 18-week domination. And that's not the only top 20 song that he has on a Billboard charts. You know what I'm saying? He also has... Um, what What is this? Uh, Against This Pain. My bad, y'all. Yeah, Against This Pain is number 18 for 17 weeks on the Billboard charts. So as y'all can see, Moneybag Yo is taking flight. 
and destroying the composition. I mean, competition. You know what I'm saying? It's not even comparable. Shout out to that man. Keep doing your thing. But next up, we got that man, Funny Mike. And Funny Mike, you know, uh, was out working out. And then uh, I guess him and his peoples, you know, ended up getting in a car crash and whatnot. You know, a uh, bad situation. But most, uh, most definitely think we're thankful that you know everybody's okay everybody made it out with their life you know what i'm saying and, and, and no real dire things happen you know what i'm saying but even after all of that situation went on you know funny mike he's still gonna remain optimistic he's still gonna re remain joyful still gonna remain you know his char charismatic self you know and uh doing what he do you know uh, stay, stick it to how he make his bread and whatnot you know what i'm saying so even after you know being at the gym working out and all these situations went bad my boy still went on you know to uh go house hopping being about his check you know what i'm saying and not letting anything ruin him but i'm gonna go ahead and show y'all everything that happened with the choir wreck first and we're gonna dive into the next go ahead Ru. go ahead Ru. y'all can see you know he uh pretty much said my dog a soldier you know what i'm saying y'all keep him in your prayers and i think you know this is pretty much the worst that happened you know nothing really bad has happened serious you know but uh we wish this man a speedy recovery and whatnot but yeah man in this next clip you know we got that boy going house hunting with his peoples and i promise you this is one of the funniest things y'all gonna see so y'all gonna want to stay tuned to the end and for all my family who made it here you know to this uh to the end of this video shout out to you peace and blessings kings and queens i love y'all with all my heart and there's no cap to that but y'all check this one out believe it so basically we'll be paying seventy five thousand for the land no we yeah basically yeah. Cause this is not. No, you can re you can redo this right. Man, now. nobody gonna remodel. You wanna go. see a house I did like this? Yeah, let me see. Man, I, Bro, you what you think I do for man. a living, baby? You'll get sacrificed if you do that. What do we get bit, bit by a rattle? <laughs> so we just came to do an investment property and wind up doing a music video. <laughs> Boy, this man is stupid, man. He started shooting the music video. I couldn't show the song, man, because of copyright reasons. But as y'all can see, y'all see him dancing and getting down and doing whatnot. But this next part, fun. It smell like dead people. In it. <coughs> oh my God. It don't smell like old people in like to you? Cat. The cat? No, dead. God. I ain't seen one of them since 2005. Last time showing a they ain't clean up before they left this. No, they in a retirement. They in a retirement, huh? Yo, watch how y'all look. Look behind you. A roach. Oh. He said, "Hey, roach. More like tens of thousands of them." But y'all keep on watching, man. It's finna get way more funny, man. This dude is hilarious. No cap. Hey, stop! Stop! Stop overreacting, bro. Roaches is. We came from this. Man, we might see something else in this. I don't like this. I ain't see? never seen a light like this. <laughs> hey, this the hair. Lingardian Leviosa. Um, this fan been through some. But it's still plugged up. It still is. So, Mac, you still live? Mac, you still live? This flow's fun to fuck. I'm not going nowhere. That's just. Watch it right there. That's so, right. and you talking about. Long, man, now nah, this the bathroom right here. We got a full bathroom. Back man, here, this, man, this whole didn't need to be demolished. This was built. No, this was bro, built. On, this was. Why are you flexing with somebody else's gun? <laughs> <man>? <laughs> me. Hey, yeah, give me my <laughs> back. <laughs> hey, man, I feel like Rose good crowd. I ain't gonna lie, this motivation or this this make me work. Hey, this make me want to work hard. No, no, no. I'm saying, hey, let's get that TV. How about? We delete the whole trailer. Add another spot to it. Yeah. Fix this up. Yeah. So Take this two the... this two acres. Yeah. We clean up the whole land. Turn it in front of my dude. Twenty five per hand. <laughs> <laughs> Stick it up. 
Hey man, that's man finna flip a roach house. <laughs> <laughs> that's not fu- Hey, I swear to God, y'all ain't coming no more. Woo! Time out, time Woo! out, look, look. Man, you booty licking mo- Yup. Yo, uh, yo, 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 stop. What? Them big stop, stop. For your Woo! Hey, that's the ice cream truck. Stop that. Stop, stop that. Stop that. Ready. Stop the ready. Man, shout out to my boy Funny Mike for the laugh, man. No cap. The roach part was the most funniest part. Then he pulled out the hammer on him. He pulled out the pepper. He was finna blast on the. Oh man, he was finna try to smoke one of the roaches. He was tripping. He was wilding. <laughs> hey, I couldn't stop laughing at that, babe. And then uh, Runic come out like he was finna uh he's finna flip a roach house. Like man, y'all dudes is crazy. And then you see E, he was kind of salty. Like man, y'all really gonna do me like that? But I'm sure E gonna do his thing, man, and put and get that thing together, man. You know what I'm saying? It's good to see, you know, these men, you know, investing in real estate, you know, buying up land, because that's the only thing that really matters at the end of the day. That's the real profit. That's the real money. You know what I'm saying? That's the universal money. Even if they stop cash or whatever right now, as long as you got land, you can sell it for whatever the next currency is going to be. So make sure you accumulate, accumulate as much equity, ownerships, pink slips, you know, that type of stuff. Get what you need. Get what you can. You feel me? You feel me? That just be a lesson to all y'all youngest, man. When you get that money, go invest in some real estate. Shout out to my man's Baton Rouge Slim. Shout out to my man's Fredo. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to uh, YB. Shout out to all of them boys. We're going to dive into that in the live later on. You know what I'm saying? Touch on all these topics a lot more in depth. So y'all let me know what y'all think about this entire situation. You know what I'm saying? And whatnot. You know, tap in with your boy on Instagram. Make sure you do that. Once again, tap in with your boy on Instagram. Third time, sound a little better. Tap in with your boy on on Instagram at all facts King KO all lowercase and if you like to support the channel you know you can tap in with me on the cash app at money sign King KO all facts all one word you know what I'm saying and also on TikTok King KO all facts just like it is on here you know what I'm saying and make sure that you like subscribe share the video ring that bell icon spam that comment section you know what I'm saying because you know your boy gonna be back with some more bangers you know what I'm saying some more real deal real trill news videos all those topics all that stuff y'all need you know what I'm saying and whatnot and make sure you keep the most high God on your side just like the lesson we taught in the beginning of the video let there be light coming out your heart not darkness don't let your dark don't let your heart be cold and to any of this stuff that's going on and remain strong remain humble and do that you know what not what not you feel me i don't know what i'm talking about anymore all i'm saying is man tap in back in with your boy later on you know what i'm saying on that live you know what i'm saying and i love y'all and appreciate y'all family stay tuned to the next video but with that being said i'm out believe it up, get up, get up, get up, get up.